That's right, fingers crossed. How's your energy? Southern Arizona, the Arizona Wildcat women's golf team barely made it to the Elite Eight and match play of the NCAA championships by just one stroke. As an eight seed, Arizona would have to go up against number one seed Stanford, who swept through play, placing first by 13 strokes more than the second place team. Yes, they were that dominant, but throw out the records and match play in the playoffs. Remember, when the Wildcats won the national championship three years ago, they also knocked off a number one seed. News for Tucson's very own David Kelly joins us with more from Scottsdale. Welcome to the picturesque Greyhawk Golf Club in Scottsdale. It's the NCAA Women's Golf Championships. And Tuesday morning, the Arizona Wildcats upset top seed Stanford to advance to the program's third straight Final Four. Let's take a look at how it all went down in match play. Head coach Laura Ionello relying on a couple of sensational sophomores. Vivian Ho here on 14 tied with the Cardinal Sadie Engelman staring down the birdie putt on a par four and she drains it. Ho goes to one up. She would win 2-1 on 15. Ya Chun Chang aka Money needed this putt to stay alive. She misses, however, money falls four and three. The match was tied 2-2 on 18. Sophomore Gile Bitte Starkute. You can tell she doesn't like this second shot. It ended up behind a bush. She would have to take a drop. Stanford's Angelina Yee need just make this par putt for the win. She misses. Then Starkute for bogey to force a playoff, and we are headed to a 19th hole, where Starkute from the fringe with a birdie chance for the win. It doesn't get much more clutch than that. The Wildcats upset Stanford three and two to advance to a third straight Final Four. It felt absolutely amazing, not gonna lie, and it's just, uh, as I was walking up to that green, Coach Jay was just saying to me, you can make it, you can make it, and the last words that he said before I put it were, make it, so I just made it. That she did, and it was on to the afternoon semifinal. Arizona taking on Mississippi, and have we not heard that already multiple times this week? For that side of the story, Paul, I'll send it back to you in the studio. Hey, that's right, David. Arizona softball team Chuck not, just knocked off Ole Miss, Mississippi, in the Tucson Regional. And now in the final four with a trip to the championship match on the line, Arizona would take on Ole Miss in the late afternoon. And in match play, ago, Arizona trailing. But got to love shots again. like this Smilling from Yusung Ho of, of the U of A right on the money, honey. Oh, She'd yeah. win that hole. That. And a bit later, her, her sister her Vivian Ho hoping to win the hole on this long putt. And B-E-A, beautiful. Certainly Arizona, works. who trailed during the first half of the semifinal, was trying so to make a comeback. Hall, the Wildcats are still 12, playing as we speak in water. Scottsdale. Last Coming look, Ole Miss was leading three and five. We will have complete highlights and results tonight at 10 o'clock. Hey, don't forget also we are just a half an hour away from the Game 2 NBA playoff showdown between the LA Lakers and the Phoenix Suns. There are plenty of U of A connections with Miles Simon being an assistant coach and uh, with the Lakers, while DeAndre Ayton, the former U of A basketball standout, is performing well in the playoffs so far this season. We will have complete highlights as well and coverage on News 4 Tucson at 10 p.m. We'll be right back.